哈哈哈哈哈哈哈哈哈哈哈哈 ！I thought it's a face. Hello and hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. All right, today I'm going to do a reaction video about the channel of Just for Love. All right, please do support this channel by subscribing it too, guys. And today we're going to see Lecola Ismo. The English language is so confusing. Okay. I can't wait to see this one because if I'm not mistaken, that uh, Ismo is from Finland or Ukraine. Oh, I'm. Forgive me if I'm wrong, right? <laughs> Before we start, I would like to thank everyone who already support me by subscribing my channel. And for those who still not yet subscribe, please do so because I really need it and I really gonna appreciate all of you guys. Thank you so much, good people. All right, without further ado, everyone, let's go and watch this video with me. Let's go. Are you guys ready? Let's get started. Um, uh, good evening. Hi, uh, I'm Ismo and, and yes, I am from Finland. Uh, Finland, yeah, yeah Finland. Hey, hey. Sorry so, for so my bad. Good to be here. I, 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 I speak English now. Yes, I, you I, are. I didn't grow up speaking English. I had to learn it later, and it's it's not easy. It's so hard. I've been speaking English for years, but I still have to look up words every day. I learn new words all the time, and I, I recently learned this word, and it's my favorite word now. I had no idea about this word until recently, and, and I, I love it. You, you must know this. Um, uh, the the meaning of the word, the meaning is that you have now poured enough coffee into my cup. Okay. And uh, and it goes, it, it goes like, it goes like. I thought it's a face. It's just like. <laughs> you know, I, I didn't know about that. I, 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 it's so good. I really enjoy that word. It's so. <laughs> it's it's so surprising, and it starts it starts really fast, and then slows down gradually. It's it, it's great. It it took me a while. It took me some time to to figure out how to spell it. <laughs> uh, but now I have it. Uh, actually, now I use it as my as my password. Oh, your password? It's it's, it's my Wi-Fi password. If somebody comes over, what's your Wi-Fi? Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> how to spell that? I really, really <laughs> love that. Uh, yeah, that uh, uh, I um, I, I I really I, I really like words and and I really enjoy words and. This is a thing I hear often. People say, like, if somebody uses a bad word, a curse word, mm -hmm. and then there's another person who doesn't like that word being used, and they want to interfere and they want to say something about that, uh -huh. the thing they always say, they yell out, they yell out, uh, language. <laughs> language. Uh, and that's it. <laughs> when people they, they say just yell out the bad word, language. Well. Mind your own okay, yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Language. Mind your language. This, this is a part is it? of that. Language. Yes, this goes into the category of language. But I feel it's a little bit broad of a statement for that situation to just <laughs> yell out language. It's like it's like the same to me. If if you see somebody about to get hit by a bus, and and you yell out transportation. <laughs> <laughs> you can't say that. Uh, uh, yeah, yes, yeah, yes, you are correct. Yes, this uh, transportation this goes under the umbrella oh. of transportation. Yes, but uh, maybe a bit more specific. Um, I actually I recently uh, went on this uh, language course where they tried to teach me to speak English better, and they made me practice this phrase. They made me practice the phrase. Um, uh, she shells, she shells. She shells. By the seashore. By the she, by the seashore. Sure. And that is fucking impossible. It's, it's, <laughs> it's. I, I don't know how anybody can pronounce that. It's so difficult. I kept trying. I tried so many times. I kept practicing, but then I stopped. Then I suddenly I stopped practicing because I realized, I realized that. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I am never gonna need to say this. 
<laughs> yeah. Am I practicing? Like, I can't even imagine a situation where, where I'd have to say... You know the thing. <laughs> like, like how, how would that situation go? Like, first of all, I, I would have to be by the seashore. By the seashore. And, and, and then, then I would have to run into someone who is uh, shelling seashells. And, <laughs> and then for some reason, for some reason, I... I, I feel you, I feel you. Point her out. And, and I would have to, I'd have to say to some third person. Uh, she? Yeah. <laughs> she is doing that. <laughs> like, why, why, why would that happen? It's, it's not, it's not gonna happen. Uh, it makes sense, yeah. I'm pretty sure that I will never run into anybody telling she shells in the first place. Because I can't imagine a worse business idea. Selling a seashores? Especially at that location. At seashells. Selling the you, seashells. You know, with business, it's all about location, location, location. And there are free, free seashells, like right next to her. So nobody is going to buy her stupid seashells. So, she shells. <laughs> so, uh, if you are selling she shells, my advice is that at least sell them as far from the she hole as, as possible. So, some, somewhere where they are scarce. So, thanks a lot, David Ismo. Thank you. <laughs>